Hey Thrivers, welcome back to Thriving with Richard Bass. Today we're diving into a topic that many of you have asked about, how cognitive behavioral therapy or CBT can benefit those with ADHD at different stages of life. Don't forget to check the description below for my workbooks based on CBT skills. Let's get started. Our first section is CBT for children with ADHD. All right, young Thrivers, let's talk about the foundation, childhood. For kids grappling with ADHD, CBT becomes a beacon of support. Picture a world where structured routines, positive reinforcement, and interactive activities merge seamlessly. In this space, children learn to identify and manage impulsive behaviors through play-based interventions, making the learning process engaging and relatable. Social skills training takes center stage, helping these young minds navigate friendships, school environments, and family interactions with newfound confidence. Consider it as a toolkit for our little thrivers, filled with strategies like behavior charts, reward systems, and mindfulness exercises. Through these, children not only grasp the concept of cause and effect, but also cultivate a sense of responsibility for their actions. As they navigate this early stage of life, CBT becomes more than a therapeutic approach. It transforms into a trusted companion, guiding them towards resilience, self-expression, and an empowered understanding of their unique strengths. Now for our second section, let's talk about CBT for teenagers with ADHD. Now let's embark on the accelerating terrain of teenagers, where the challenges shift gears, and so does the power of CBT. As our thrivers enter their teenage years, the journey becomes more intricate. Imagine CBT as a trusted guide, helping teens not only navigate the stormy seas of hormonal changes, but also providing a compass for self-discovery and growth. Here, CBT delves into the realm of self-awareness, assisting teens in recognizing their strengths, weaknesses, and unique qualities. Goal setting becomes a key component, empowering these young minds to envision their futures and establish realistic steps to achieve their aspirations. Time management takes center stage as school's demands intensifies, teaching teens the crucial art of balancing academics, extracurriculars, and personal time. Picture a space where teens can express themselves freely, equipped with coping strategies that go beyond the academic realm. CBT in this phase instills confidence, resilience, and effective problem-solving skills. It's not just about managing ADHD symptoms, it's about embracing the journey of self-discovery and personal growth. Adolescents armed with CBT tools become architects of their destiny, navigating the complexities of adolescence with grace and resilience. And for our final section, let's talk about CBT for adults with ADHD. Now let's explore the landscape of adulthood, where the demands are higher, but so is the potential for growth. For our adult thrivers, CBT becomes a cornerstone for personal empowerment and success. Imagine stepping into a realm where understanding ADHD is not just about managing symptoms, but unlocking the full potential within. In the realm of adulthood, CBT takes on a transformative role, aiding individuals in redefining negative thought patterns that might have lingered around since childhood. Stress management becomes an art form, with mindfulness techniques and relaxation strategies helping adults navigate the often overwhelming demands of work, relationships, and personal responsibilities. Think of CBT as a toolkit filled with powerful instruments like cognitive restructuring and problem-solving techniques. Adults learn to harness the strengths that come with ADHD, turning challenges into opportunities. Organizational skills are honed, enhancing efficiency and productivity in both personal and professional spheres. The focus shifts from understanding ADHD to actively using its unique aspects to thrive in various aspects of life. That's a wrap on how CBT benefits those with ADHD at different ages. Remember, you can find more in-depth CBT skills in my workbooks linked in the description. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments. Thrive on!